Yo, what's up guys? Sorry you haven't heard from me for a while. I have been doing some vlogging, have been lazy about the editing, so here's a video of some clips that I took. I hope you enjoy. Sorry if it's a bit disjointed, but uh, just enjoy uh, some clips of the past month of my life. It's race day today, baby. We're not in LA. I thought the race was in LA. I think everyone thought the race was in LA. But yeah. we're in Orange County. Spence is racing the 800 at 8 p.m. So it's gonna be a big day of me being his little bitch, um, <clears throat> resting and making sure that uh, everyone's all prepped up for the race and stuff. So it'll be fun. Really excited for these races. Um, see if I can get some footage of me actually there. But I'm gonna be kind of busy with the with the camera and getting pictures and footage and stuff. But uh, it's gonna be fun. It's been a while since a race. Everyone's hyped. Everyone's fit. It's gonna be good. A little after six, just made it to the meet. Spencer's let me wear this sweet jacket of his because I lost my Brooks jacket, but we're excited. <laughs> Race is at eight. You should watch the stream. It's already happened, but hopefully you watch the stream. I'm like, oh yeah, you're good. <laughs> just uh, got past the security checkpoint. We came very close to not getting my name. Somehow wasn't on the list. So name drop, the meet director got on in. So we made it. Now a little after seven. Races will be going off in about half an hour. The atmosphere here is absolutely perfect. Um, it just feels so good to be back at a track meet. I was just talking with Danny about how it's been a long time since anyone's really been at the track meet. <clears throat> Weather's pretty good, not a lot of wind. Hopefully there'll be some fast times run. Probably not gonna get much footage, much more footage on my channel here, but definitely check out Spencer's channel because we'll be filming that. Um, hopefully there's some cool shots and all that. So check that out and stay tuned for here because who knows what else is gonna be on this channel. It's um, Sunday, about one o'clock, bit of a late start. We went and bought a bike rack, which was kind of stressful because we went to a really far Dick's, which apparently is the smallest Dick's in the country, um, which is kind of a funny thing to say. And then they didn't have the bike rack that they said they had online and in store they said they had three, but they couldn't find it. So then we ended up going to a sporting goods store that was one minute away from the hotel. Um, so we got a bike rack. Now we're headed to LA, probably gonna hit a beach, chill. Might catch up with Aaron, probably gonna crash at his crib. But yeah, definitely the races were pretty cool last night. Some pretty fast times. It was a lot of fun to watch. The 5K was crazy. We didn't have any guys in it, but it was still pretty fun. Dying in, dying in. Feeling pretty good about it. <laughs> Yo, uh, so at this place called the Sada, what, what town are we in? We're no, on our, we're somewhere, we're somewhere a little bit north of where we were staying. Going, <laughs> going towards LA. Stop at this place called Asados. I got some breakfast tacos, so we'll see how they stack up against the breakfast burritos and the breakfast quesadilla. Sounds pretty good. Coming with spicy tots, so very excited for that. Um, shout out Knockaround. Make the sickest shades in the game. Sponsor me too. Don't just give Ali free things. Give me free sunglasses too. Wow. Looks delicious. What they make you do is uh, orange tortillas. He read the menu for 45 minutes. <laughs> while ordering and while there was a line. <laughs> what did you get, Allie? I got uh, the something machaca. Nom nom nom. <laughs> the thing is, I is. am starting to break. I'm going to buy it going in. Homie just hooked us up with all these salsas, but very good. Like an 8.2 out of 10. That food was incredible. Maybe higher than an 8.2, maybe like an 8.7. It was delicious. I didn't really take into account the tater tots. Yeah, I finished a bit quicker than them. It's, uh, <laughs> you know, you know, you know, it's the way it is. What's up, everyone? We just made it to somewhere near Yosemite. We're going to the park tomorrow. Pretty tired. Didn't get very good sleep the past couple nights. Crashed on Aaron's couch last night. Shout out those guys. Uh, Jackson, Aaron, and Owen for letting us crash there. Fun bike ride today with those guys too. Check out my Strava if you want to see it. It was a fun ride, kind of windy. My bike just it doesn't work in the wind. It goes backwards. Heart rate went up to like 170, which was insane because it was a bike ride. But just got to the Airbnb. Spence and I both weren't feeling too hot in that car, and it was just a long ride. Probably going to go to bed in five minutes at 8.15. But tomorrow should be cool, so there should be some sweet footage of Yosemite. So... Stay tuned. Made it to Yosemite. It's pretty freaking sweet. Uh, gonna go on a hike. So, pretty excited. Also, right when we drove in, we saw El Capitan from Free Solo, and that freaking hill or wall of rock is so much bigger than I thought it was. It's absolutely breathtaking. So, shout out Alex Honnold for free soloing it.
on guys? We're on our trip back to Seattle. Spencer and I were just talking, this is the first time we're returning to a city. So Seattle's pretty much home at this point. I ran in my endorphin pros for this quick five miles shakeout run in the middle of a car ride strap right here because I, could, oh, I couldn't get into the back because we have so much stuff. And I could only find my left ghost and my left boost. And the only shoes I could grab were my endorphins. So it was an easy run. Gotta keep driving, we have like nine hours to go, which is pretty long. It's a 13 piece today, so I'm packed in back here. It's, you know, tough. That was a 13 hour trip. I looked like this the whole time. We made it back, 12.45 a.m. It's Thursday now, back in Seattle though. Staying at Allie's house for a couple days, actually for a couple weeks. Pretty tired, having trouble talking, but ride's over. It's Sunday, March 21st, 3.30 a.m. Gonna catch a plane to Miami to meet up with the fam, so follow along. Made it to Miami with uh, my brother and my dad and my mom and my sister and my brother's girlfriend are over there. Getting dinner, gonna be pretty good. Putting on some sweatshirts, it's got a little chilly, but uh, Shout out Knock Round for incredible sunglasses. Oh, man. <laughs> it's, a it's a onion loaf made for two people. It's the size of like a baby. The size of two oh. huge people. Two size of my forearm. But at the same time, let's remember. We'll take a picture. Couldn't kill it, you know, it's made for two. Yellowtail Matakube. Shrimp and scallops, yum. Uh -oh. Put it in your mouth. Slow mo shot. <laughs> slow mo shot. Oh, I have to get a. I have to get a shrimp. No, not you, slow mo. <laughs> Tuesday morning. Today. Eating my oat cakes. <laughs> Dad thinks that he's funny. Mom is. Uh, Mom is patiently waiting for her cup of coffee. Been waiting for thirty-five years. Love the shirt, Dad. I took, I, I, made, I watched the sunrise today, something you've probably never seen. So I thought maybe I'll show you some pictures. I woke up at 8.30 and I'm still on West Coast time. I don't think I'm sleeping in that late. Hey everyone, uh, I feel like I haven't really explained what's going on. So I'm uh, on vacation with my family in Key Largo, Florida. Here for like five days, got on Sunday, leaving on Friday. <clears throat> Super fun to be back with the family. Last week was, it was tough. I'm sure you guys saw Allie's video of her and Spencer in Alaska. I was stuck in Seattle all alone that whole week, and let me tell you, it was pretty freaking boring. I know what you're thinking, Will, why not film and edit a vlog if you're so bored all day long? It's a great question. But uh, anyway, I just finished up a run here. It's the running, not great. It's kind of just really flat, pretty hot, and really straight. I tried to mix it up a little bit. I'll, I'll throw Strava here. If you guys have been following me on Strava, you would know where I am, so I'm not putting out enough vlogs and you still want to keep up. Strava is the best way I post every day. Yeah, the runs haven't been great. I feel like I'm finally getting back in shape though, now that we're back at like sea level. I feel like I'm not a great responder to altitude training. Um, I think that's a thing. I just feel like I trained so much better in Seattle. I did a nice long run on Sunday, 14 miles finally, something a bit longer. It's like 639 pace, it felt, it felt nice. Um, I know you guys are also thinking, Will, the haircut, it's amazing. I know, uh, shout out, uh, great cuts, not great clips. It's like a mix of great clips and super cuts. I don't think it's a chain. It's on uh, Aurora and 105th, the corner of that, up in uh, Northgate in Seattle. If you guys live in Seattle, I highly recommend it. It's just this one lady. I've got my haircut there twice. Both times I've been super happy with the haircut. I think it looks pretty good. So yeah, if you guys want to get your haircut, definitely check out Great Cuts. Yeah, we're gonna go snorkeling later today. Gonna try and get some footage of that maybe. Obviously, I don't have like an underwater camera, but uh, I'll get some footage of like the boat and stuff. My family are some fun people, so I'll try and get some personality clips of them but I'm terrible about vlogging and it feels weird when we're just like hanging out to whip out a camera, but we'll see what happens. You excited to go snorkeling, Dad? Yeah, this is gonna be great. <laughs> what kind of fish are you hoping to see? I'd like to see some parrotfish. I'd like to see a grouper would be great. Um, kind of spearfish any of them even for dinner? A reef shark would be kind of good. <laughs> you know, that would be a story to tell. An octopus would be a dream. But we'll never see an octopus. They're too, they're masters of camouflage. 
If you can spot one, you're a master of. Well, you can't. You're a master hunter. You can't. You can't. But uh, it would be cool to see a lobster. Something creepy crawly on the bottom. <laughs> the, the, the great thing is to dive down, look under the reef, and see what other people on the surface do not see. Smart. That's the goal. You excited to uh, snorkel, Ben? Hey, Will. I've been dreaming about this my whole life, so if you want to make fun of me for it, let me see the fish in peace. I'd be really happy about that. Thank you. Looking good, feeling good. You gonna go snorkeling, Mom? I am. Wait till you see me with ru running with the sharks. What kind of fish you want to see the most? Uh, parrot. Uh, like a bird? No, parrot fish. That's all I know. Hopefully you see one. Yeah. Dad's an octopus. What do you think about that? No. Don't want to see an octopus. I do not want to see an octopus, and I don't want to see a shark. You see an octopus where you slap it? Yes, I'll, I'll protect you. Don't worry. <laughs> Let's see that face, Dad. A little too much sunscreen? <laughs> what sunscreen? <laughs> you said it was less than Ben's. Well, then you put a lot more on. No, I have. <laughs> oh. You can't see anything. It's too dark. Oh, he's got a tell me. It's like eye black, but eye white. Instead of a great white shark, it's a great white <laughs> old man. Great white mice, of Snorkeling, it was a lot of fun. Oh, no. pass oh, now we're eating God, some tacos and stuff. What's the matter now? But it's a I disaster. No. Didn't get all the tacos, so we're short on food and it took a long time, but I did get fudge. And my food's all here. <laughs> Made it back to Seattle. Finally, nice and cool run. So the driver here, Spencer. Check out his video for the updates, but it's a bike. It's a bike for a minute. It's a bike. But yeah, end the vlog here. We'll see if this even comes out. I might not edit it, but yeah. Uh, hope you enjoy the vlog back. Yeah, comment down below comments so that this video does better. Peace out.